In my 34 years of being a dietitian, I never thought I'd see the day when I'd recommend whole milk. But here I am. You know, nutrition science is funny. It's a science. We get more data, we change our advice. In 2013, Washington State University released the results of a groundbreaking new study that examined the milk fat composition of organic and conventional whole milk. Over the course of 18 months, scientists analyzed 384 whole milk fat samples from 14 commercial milk processors across the United States. The organic whole milk tested came exclusively from pasture-raised organic valley cows. Our major finding is that uh, while all milk is, is healthy, uh, organic milk is e even healthier. And in fact, organic milk uh, is 2.5-fold better than conventional milk in, in terms of its content of uh, health-promoting uh, fatty acids. The Washington State University study looked specifically at Organic Valley whole milk and found that that particular milk contained more omega-3 fatty acids than conventional whole milk. And omega-3s are very important in preventing chronic diseases. They're also very important in the diets of pregnant women, lactating women, and young children because they are critical in developing brain, eye, and nerve development. Grass and forages are the building blocks for the uh, heart-healthy omega-3 fatty acids, while corn and corn silage, the, the primary feeds uh, uh, given to cattle on conventional dairy farms are the building blocks of omega-6s. And what's happened in the American diet is we've gotten out of balance. We have many more omega-6s than omega-3s, and we need to find a way to reduce omega-6 and increase omega-3s. Come on! The primary reason why organic milk contains such a healthier mix of fatty acids is the grass and forage-based feeds that make up uh, the major portion of the ration on most organic dairy farms. As an organic valley dairy farmer, I say the proof is in the pasture. I knew this all along looking at my animals and how healthy they are. We know that those dairy cows that spend more time on pasture are going to produce milk that contains more of these beneficial fatty acids both omega-3 fatty acids and conjugated linoleic acid. We care about this because CLA has important properties that help prevent cancer, help prevent unwanted weight gain, and can help prevent chronic heart disease. We're learning now that not all fat is the same, and uh, while all Americans need to watch their overall fat intake, it's, it's perhaps even more important to seek out uh, and assure that, that a, a person includes the right kind of fats in their diet. And without a doubt, we need fewer omega-6 fatty acids, which are very high in things like soybean oil and corn oil and fried foods, and we need more of these omega-3 fatty acids that are high in uh, milk and especially organic milk. If we want those beneficial omega-3 fatty acids and we want those beneficial CLA fatty acids, we need to be drinking whole milk. I think the beauty of the Washington State University study is that it shows that how we raise our animals, our agricultural methods, are very important in determining our public health. We are what we eat, and if we want to be well, we have to pay attention to how we raise our food. I love to be an organic valley dairy farmer because I'm bringing health to the earth, health to the soil, health to the plants, the animals, and ultimately to mankind.